Imagine, if you will, a world beneath our feet, a place of mystery and intrigue, home to an advanced civilization far beyond our own. It's a tantalizing thought, isn't it? Welcome, my dear listeners, to the enigma of the hollow earth theory. This theory, far from being a recent product of wild imaginations, has roots stretching back to the 17th century. The concept of a subterranean earth, teeming with life and advanced civilizations, is as old as mankind itself. The great astronomer Edmund Halley, the man who gave us Halley's Comet, proposed the idea of a hollow earth filled with life. John Cleve Sims, an American army officer, took this theory a step further, claiming that there were massive entrances at the poles leading to the interior world. The idea was further popularized by Jules Verne, the acclaimed French author, in his novel, Journey to the Center of the Earth. Verne's story brought the hollow earth theory into the realm of public consciousness, painting a vivid picture of a subterranean world filled with prehistoric creatures and lost civilizations. But here's where the tale takes an intriguing turn. Admiral Richard E. Byrd, an American naval officer and pioneering polar explorer, allegedly encountered a civilization within the Earth during a flight over the North Pole. His diary entries speak of a lush, green landscape beneath the ice, inhabited by an advanced civilization. Yet the validity of his claims remains a topic of heated debate. Byrd's expeditions, including Operation High Jump, have ignited speculation about the existence of an underground world, known as Agartha. Conspiracy theorists point to Nazi maps and a letter from a U-boat navigator as evidence of the Earth's hollow interior. The Nazis, it is said, conducted experiments to support the belief in a concave Earth. Ancient cultures, too, have tales of underground realms. The Greeks spoke of Hades, the underworld, while Hindu and Celtic lore tell of subterranean worlds connected to Agartha, Atlantis, Lemuria, and Mu. The Hindu epic, the Mahabharata, describes Patala, a subterranean world at war with the Agarthans. So, does a hidden world exist beneath our feet? The evidence is a mixed bag. On one hand, we have historical anecdotes, ancient tales, and the controversial diary of Admiral Byrd. On the other hand, mainstream science firmly rejects the hollow earth theory, pointing to geological evidence that supports a solid earth. In the end, the existence of a subterranean civilization remains a captivating mystery, a tale that fires our imagination and challenges our understanding of the world. Whether fact or fiction, the hollow earth theory continues to captivate and intrigue us. After all, who knows what mysteries lie beneath the surface? Only time will tell. Until then, keep an open mind and never stop questioning.